Welcome in Nantucket. This is the way I spent my holiday here in this teeny little house which we got 50 years ago in the family. Nantucket is the, pla is the place where the 0.1% of the American population is. If you look, for example, there, that house is $25 million. There in the back, there is an, uh, the chimney of Tommy Hilfinger's home, um, which is enjoying uh, two weeks of his holiday every year. And that those houses are extremely, insanely expensive. And behind me lives Eric Smeet from Google. And they have servants and everything. I mean, it's just really insane the differences in income which you have here. Now, we got it 55 years ago from our aunt, and we have the tiniest house. I'll uh, show you how it is, and I'll put it in my, uh, I'll put it in the, um, in the notes. Now, what do I do during these vacations? I order gadgets from my biggest friend, Amazon.com, which is worth 400 billion euros by now, and I love it. I can order it immediately. The first thing I'm I was trying to do is I was trying to order a Bluetooth microphone. And a Bluetooth microphone is such a simple idea. I can just have a nice quality sound, and um, but I cannot find them. The only way you can order them is as a karaoke, as a karaoke solution. And I ordered a couple of them. I also have a golden one. And let's uh, let's see what the quality is of that uh, the quality is of that microphone. I'm going to try that out. So now I'm connected to the karaoke microphone, and I can walk around. This also has a loudspeaker built in. It's $39. It's cool. And, you know, my Bluetooth, I can, just, I can just walk around. It's really the way I want to work. And normally these phones are extremely expensive, and Bluetooth would be the solution, but the quality of the sound is horrible. Then, of course, I love these kinds of sticks uh, where I can make an, uh, a selfie, uh, selfie movie. And uh, this is a really good one. Very long, and a selfie stick. And the nice thing is that this thing has a Bluetooth remote control underneath, so you can order, you can put the camera, turn the camera on and off. And that's really this one has a pause uh, solution. This one sells for twenty nine ninety five, and I have this one, and I also have a smaller one, which is um, you know really handy if you want to take it with you. So I am trying those things out, but I'm also doing it more professional. Of course, my my son Vince is now uh, being the cameraman, and he is doing a really good job holding the camera still. But this one, this thing, which is from uh, CGI, this is a gyroscope. This is supposed to make the camera unbelievable stable. You can walk, and it it gives fantastic pictures. I'll show you in. Uh, I'll I'll send a uh, link. So that looked amazing, but I can't get it to work. So I have to go through the manual CGI and install the app. And I don't know why it doesn't work, but I will make it work the next time. And of course, I read books. This is a fantastic book, I heard. It's from Vivek Watline. It's from the Singularity University tradition. So everything is great. Everything is big data and everything is computing power and everything is artificial intelligence and driverless cars. And the whole world is going to be completely different. Manufacturing, real estate, cities, everything is going to change. And the nice thing about this guy is that he's not only extremely positive, like I normally am, but he is also um, he lo also looks at the negative consequences. It's a, of course a jobless society, which means that people could be extremely rich and extremely poor, or we could divide it up a little bit. So I'm going to read that and give a review next week. And what I also do is I'm testing out this scale. I'm a, I'm on a diet, so uh, no um, vegan and um, and, and, and vegan, healthy, no carbots. And uh, this is a scale, one by one. And it has a very nice uh, app. So I can keep track of my weight, my BMI, and all my scores. So that's also going to be in the review next week. But of course, what I do at Nantucket especially is just going to the beach. There is a fantastic beach here. The weather is always wonderful. It's never too hot. And I'm having time with my kids. And my kids are showing me the most latest and greatest game, which next week you will uh, see in a review of. What's the name of the game? Train Station. And why is it so cool? Because you get, you get to do your own trains, and you get to make them, and you get to assemble them. Including Hyperloop, eh? Yes, and Maglevs, and... Yeah, so we're going to review that uh, that next week. It's a fantastic game to, to build your own train 
a network and to order them, have contracts, and uh, I love those games. If kids play those games, I'm really happy. So that's what I do. Oh yeah, there's also some incredible lectures, which I'll uh, try to interview some people about. And uh, I'm just relaxing, and I hope you will too. See you next week.